Hello guys, this is Christina here, Panacham, and you're watching my YouTube channel. And if you're new to the channel, please subscribe, comment down below, like, and make sure you tick the little bell because uh, you'll get notification if I make a video update. Now, let's take a look on the four-hour time frame here. We're gonna start on a larger time frame. Uh, I'm gonna look at daily weekly as well weekly we are at the bottom all right of this uh resistance okay hopefully it's gonna you know, uh, retest and then continuation to the downside but of course if you look at the daily we have um close below the resistance which is around here right let me mark it out to you guys right here this is the resistance all right it has uh, closed down so I believe it will not go beyond this resistance if it does then it's probably reversing now there's a chance that it might reverse if we look at, at the four hour time frame here right um, basically when the market um, usually when it does this uh, it usually indicates that the market might be reversing which is the candle for four hours close fully on the last candle here now um why would i say it could be uh you know it could be reversing because the all four time frame MACD is going up and as well as we might have a bull divergence like it or not uh, excuse me i had my breakfast like it or not it is there Okay, but of course, I would really love the market to really come down here and finish this. So if it does not, then this could be a, an expanded flat, and this was a wave 1 and 2, and we're going to go up, alright, uh, to a larger, um, a larger expanded flat, okay. So that's my uh, idea right now, because... It, it is there so I assume that it is there okay so then we check it out on the three hour time frame it looks like it wants to cross up as well two hour time frame as well uh, 30 minutes has already crossed up okay let's take a look on the CCI all right guys basically the whole structure is looking bullish so I'm expecting to long the market uh, on the pullback which pullback let me see um, I'm looking to long the market on the pullback here okay let me clear that up I'm going for three minutes time frame let's take a look okay I'm gonna draw a trend line here okay and I believe that um, you know, it's, 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 uh, leading diagonal, okay, like that, okay, and I'm probably just gonna do some kind of sideways, and then have a quick move down, and then pump, now, um, I do have problem having count here, but if I, you know, took the time and really count it, it actually makes sense as well. Okay. Uh, but of course, I have this idea, idea that this could be a, an expanded flat as well. Yeah. Okay. So uh, it's probably gonna, you know, do something like that. Okay. So nonetheless, if it comes down, we're gonna take the long and see what happens. All right. So um, there is an idea of thinking that you know this whole structure was an idea diet, no? All right, like that. And the countless one, two, and this is a three, four, five. Okay. Uh, there was an idea that this could be an ending diagonal, that it, it is done. 
which means it was uh, some kind of an A, B, C. It is done, then we are uh, going for an upside. Now, of course, if it uh, hopefully it comes down because I kind of like to go short, um, thinking that this was coming down. Uh, technically, I fumbled, but it was a mistake. Everybody does that. So I'm expecting. Uh, so I'm expecting the market to pull back before going up, right? So I'm gonna exit and take a long and put a stop loss here. I'm gonna attempt for another one. I think it's a third attempt long, right? So basically, I'm playing the idea that thinking that the market has finished, um, because um, I mean, obviously, it's a pretty kind of obvious play that this could be done, right? And kind of have the you know the divergence to the upside. Okay, so um. Market going to prolong the correction as well with an extra flat and then coming down. So it's going to waste a few lot of time and then going sideways. I still believe that. So um, I'm, I'm waiting for the market, you know, to show me the real exact move. But at the moment, I'm looking at uh, to the upside because of the indicator. Now let's go to the 12-hour time frame here. I haven't checked it yet. So if I go to the 12-hour time frame, I think it could be crossing soon. Okay, it looks like it, it wants to, but it hasn't really started yet. But of course, if it, if it's able to close above this EMA seven and above, and I think it could be going up already. So uh, waiting for that for reversal and the six hours has already had the uh, bull divergence as you can see here and overall I think this is it I think the market is reversing here so I'm preparing to long the market I, I, I'm turning bullish now I'm not expecting the market for another deep I, I'm expecting for another up move okay guys so watching out that we might go for another up move so uh, I'm currently in a short, but I might cut my short right now, although it may retrace, I, but I really like to give it up now because because after seeing this, I feel like the market might uh, pump more than coming down. So I don't want to take risks. I might cut it right now, right? So guys, um, let me let me do as I said it. I'm going to cut it, although I think the market might you know pump, but uh, I'm going to cut it anyway. I'm gonna do it right now <laughs> on my phone. Hold on a sec. Take a look. Okay, I've cut my short and I'm gonna wait for the breakout, uh, for the uh, you know, for it to cross the EMA and the candle close here. It's gonna close in uh, one hour, all right. Uh, with the candle able to close close upside, I'm gonna take a long, probably wait for the pullback, then take a long as well. Uh, nonetheless, it's uh, gonna be really a great swing to the upside. If it does uh, uh, come back here, I mean, if it if it really does come back, come back up, right? Okay, guys. Um, thank you for watching for me video. If you like my content, if you like my TA, if you think that it's uh, really uh, giving you some uh, great insight, please uh, subscribe and like, share it to your friends. I hope that this video helped you a lot, and hopefully you make money out of it. So. Um, I'm expecting the market to, you know, go back up here as an expand of flat like that. Okay, guys. So I gotta be patient about it. It, it might happen. Uh, I think it most likely will happen. Um, it's just that you have to be really patient about, you know, looking at the market at different perspective. Uh, definitely, this is one of it. Um, the the chance uh before I mean yesterday night I still think that the market comes down, but then today this moment I think the most likely it will go up. 
chances that it might go up has increased this back uh, expected to be going upside really soon all right guys thank you for watching for my uh, on my video and talk to you guys later bye